Hello everyone. Today let us discuss about personality disorders. Personality is made up of a characteristic pattern of thoughts, feelings and behaviors that makes a person unique. Personality arises from within the individuals and remains fairly consistent throughout the life. Personality disorders are grouped into three clusters. Cluster A includes odd and eccentric personalities. It includes paranoid personality disorder. It is characterized by generalized mistrust and suspiciousness. The patient believes that others are exploiting or deceiving the person. Friends are untrustworthy and not loyal. The spouse or partner is unfaithful. There is hidden meaning in neutral or friendly remarks. Many patients have feeling of self-importance and think they are unusually talented. Next, schizoid personality disorder. A person with this disorder is markedly detached from others and has little desire for close relationships. There is excessive preoccupation with fantasy. The patients show emotional coldness. Next, schizotypal personality disorder. Exhibit marked eccentricities of thoughts, perception and behavior. They show magical thinking, characterized by social anxiety, inability to make close relationships, suspiciousness and ideas of reference, unusual perceptual experiences, oddities in speech and magical thinking. Next, Cluster B. They are dramatic, emotional and erratic. It includes antisocial personality disorder. It is disregard for and violation of the rights of the other and the rules of the society. Next, borderline personality disorder. The central feature of borderline personality disorder is a pervasive pattern of unstable and intense interpersonal relationship. The patient make recurrent suicidal thoughts carry out the act of self-mutilation like cutting or burning. Next, Histronic Personality Disorder With this disorder, they display excessive emotionality and attention-seeking behavior. Next, Narcissistic Personality Disorder These patients are grandiose and require admiration from others. Symptoms of Narcissistic Personality Disorder can be confused with manic phase of bipolar disorder. Next, cluster C. Patients are anxious and fearful. It includes avoidant or anxious personality disorder. The patients with this disorder are shy and socially inhibited. They have low self-esteem. Next, dependent personality disorder. This is characterized by a submissive clinging behavior and need to be taken care of by others even in day-to-day -day affairs. Next, Obsessive Compulsive or Anarchistic Personality Disorder People with this disorder are markedly preoccupied with orderliness, perfectionism and control. Now, let us see types of personalities. Type A Personality These individuals are impatient, time-conscious, highly competitive, ambitious, hostile, and aggressive. They have difficulty in relaxing and are concerned about their status. Type A behavior is expressed in three major symptoms. Time urgency and impatience, free-floating hostility, and competitiveness. Next, Type B personality. Type B individuals are opposite of Type A they are relaxed and easygoing and have no sense of urgency. They do not get stressed. Next, Type C Personality A Type C Personality is designated to individuals who appear to cancer prone and someone who responds to stress with depression and sense of hopelessness and has high risk of developing cancer. They tend to be introverted, respectful, eager to please and complain. Type D Personality This type of individuals have increased level of anxiety 
irritation and depressed mood type d personality is associated with increased risk of cardiovascular problems thank you